Hi, I'm Christian Mason with Deuter Backpacks. Today I'm going to talk to you about our Transalpine packs. Um, as you can see, the Transalpine packs are larger volume packs that are oriented towards bike packing and also bike commuting. We do them in three different sizes, a 30 liter, a 26 liter for women, and then a 25 liter. So the features of the <clears throat> Transalpine packs are this particular series of packs features what we call our air stripes suspension. You can see here that there's a nice channel that runs down the middle, a softer outer foam with a sculpted inner foam that's skyped out, so it offers good ventilation brakes horizontally and vertically. 80% of your pack won't make contact with your back and then through that you get um, less sweat buildup on your back. Here you can see we have um, nice generous hip belts with mesh and two zippered pockets, good shoulder straps with good, nice, soft to the touch foam with load adjusters. Um, hidden away in the pack is a rain cover, and you can see that here. So this is the rain cover when it's deployed. You can remove the rain cover, which is a nice feature, <clears throat> um, to carry less weight. Internally, there's a bottom compartment pocket, and then inside of here, as you can see, is a zippered shelf or divider. A small little valuables pocket here. A helmet holder that you can also carry layers with. And then internally, lots of great pockets for organization. And then inside of the pack, you can see additional little pocket here for your reservoir. Another pocket here to sort out valuables. If I were to open this up, you can see this foam pad. The foam pad is removable, and it's a nice little sitting pad or a great place as a standing pad to change. Additionally, on the inside of this suspension is a malleable aluminum stay where I could custom mold the pack to my back. It's really easy. You just put a little pressure, as you could see there, and I start to mold it to reduce any gaps. Okay? So, this is the Transalpine 30. It's a 129 retail. It's an excellent bike packing pack. And like I said, we do it in a 30 liter, a 26 liter for women. You can see the women's packs are always indicated with the flower. The flower actually doubles as a hair tie and is removable. And then here you can see the SL. SL stands for short length or slim line. So shorter here, shapely shoulder straps, Nice soft outer edge and inner edge, and then a hip belt that is shorter, but also sits on the pack like this, so you get an excellent fit for a person with a shorter torso. Made by women for women's use is the Transalpine 26 SL. And then the 25 has all the same features as the 26 and 30, just in a smaller volume and a different color. So just to show the, the new updated version of the Transalpine 30 again, just a new colorway um, and new blocking on the pack, so it's got a really clean look. The other feature that we've updated is this strap actually tucks into a little garage in here, and you can see that here, so it's totally clean. If I were to pull on this end, it can expand open more, but then it's tucked away here, so as I pull this out, you can see that it stays nice and clean. So that's what's new, and here's the comparison of the old to the new. Just a cleaned up aesthetic there. Today I'm going to talk to you about our Compact 10 Air EXP. So the Deuter um, pack system that's notorious as uh, an indicator of who we are, what we do, is this style of back where you have excellent ventilation here and here from a tension mesh back panel made of spring steel. This is what we call the air comfort back. The air comfort back will reduce perspiration by 25%, so you'll sweat 25% less with this style of back system. Um, not only in the back system will we reduce sweat, but also in the shoulder and the hip belts. In this model, as you can see, we have two mesh zippered pockets, one here and here, an adjustable sternum strap, and the ability to run a reservoir down this shoulder or the other shoulder. On the front side of the compact, it's a very clean design. Um, one unique aspect is under here, you can see there's a rain cover. 
that'll deploy out. When it, deploy it deploys out, it looks like this. There's also a helmet holder that deploys out. So you can see here, the helmet holder will come out and it'll clip onto these points right here. Okay. Um, another unique aspect of this model is the ability for the whole pack to have great access. Stuff it pocket here, mesh there. A great place here for all your tools and tool kit and so forth. And then additionally, we run a zippered expander. So for those days where you're carrying a lot of equipment, this pack can zip and expand open, giving you additional volume for big long days on the trail. To access your reservoir, we run side entry. So here is where the reservoir is concealed. The reservoirs that we use are the streamer reservoirs by source, made from a polyethylene in the main reservoir and the tube. So it's 100% taste free. And then really easy access to open up, bring this to the sink, open it up, fill it. And then you can see it's very easy to clean. All you have to do is no scrubbing required because of the crystalline-like polyethylene material we use. You just place this in there and it'll dry itself out overnight. Additionally, you can pop the hose off. So you just press and the whole hose will come off. So the compact comes in a 10 liter and in an eight liter. The eight liter is a women's specific pack, always indicated where the flower comes in a turquoise color. 129 respectively on the 10, 125 with the reservoir on the eight liter. That's the compact air EXP. So this is um, another model from the line that we call the Race EXP Air. The model I'm holding in my right hand, this is the new version for 2013. This is the current version. The current version is our most popular um, bike pack for, for sure, a mountain biking application. And we also see folks using these for hiking and additionally uh, bike commuting. As you can see, it's the ventilated back that we're known for with the air comfort back. This model uses vertical stays that are made from a spring steel. So what we're known for is the ability to do this and it'll always bounce back um, with a ventilated back. This will reduce perspiration by 25%, not only in the back panel, but also in the shoulder you get ventilation. And then a nice simple uh, little hip belt that you see here. In the new version, what we've done is we've added We've gone to this new style of back, also with the air comfort and the ventilation on the three sides and the tension mesh panel. But here we're using spring steel stays that are in the form of an X. So the back can actually move with you a little bit, which is nice. And then you get a nice mesh wing to reduce that sweat buildup and a nice hip belt that you see here. What we've done that's new is we've kept that clean, sleek design, but freshened it up and lightened up the fabric a little bit, reducing the weight of the overall pack. Again, very clean, nice zippered pocket here. And then like the compacts, it also has the helmet holder that deploys out and then the rain cover that deploys out. And additionally being EXP, that stands for expander. So you can see you can expand out the volume of the pack. So on those long days, you can really load it down. Will be 129 retail with a three liter streamer reservoir. Really clean design, one of our best sellers.